Valley News as the Los Angeles Clippers preparation for a contest against the Houston Rockets. Get ready. It's game time. Stay tuned. Coach, what would you say your philosophy is as a coach, and what image are you trying to impart onto your players? My philosophy of a coach, as a coach, is building habits, helping young guys build habits, right? So, um, obviously, I came into this situation when I first got the job, it was very different than it is now. Um, but I've always been throughout my 20 whatever year career about helping young guys and vets for that matter get better and play well and play well individually and have that individual success bleed into team success as a group. What was the second part of your The question? image, what, what the team mentality, what, <clears throat> what type of image are you trying to impart into them as well? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't necessarily say there's, a, there's an image. Uh, I, I would like to say that we're about growth, we're about work, we're about doing things the right way, we're about uh, working through adversity because as a young team we're going to find some adversity, but um, getting past that is part of life. It's for all of us. Everybody in this room has adversity and it's how you deal with that adversity. So. Um, my job is to model that for them, but also tell them about it and give them examples and help them through it. How do you stay positive in the times like that? <clears throat> what, what, do you, what do you do? Is there anything that you... I'm generally a positive person. Okay. I mean, every, every once in a while I'll come into one of these super grumpy, after the Portland game I was grumpy. <laughs> 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 but for the most part, I'm, I'm a positive person, so hopefully it rubs off on everybody around me, and I try to have positive people around me. Eric Gordon, long-time Clipper, now a Houston Rocket. He is, all summer he was in the gym with our young guys, working, you know, doing the drills, uh, showing them what it is to be a pro. Uh, he's not necessarily one to be super vocal, but when it's time, he'll let them know what, it, what needs to be done and when it needs to be done and how it needs to be done and, and all those things. So he's a big part of uh, our growth as a group because he's the guy who has the know-how <laughs> and has been there before and has been in big playoff games and has been you know, from team to team and, and he's seen a little bit of everything. When it comes to pick and roll coverage, he's guarded thousands and thousands of pick and rolls, and we have guys who've guarded hundreds. <laughs> so he is uh, a guy that we lean on, and I lean on when it comes to a few things, when it comes to helping with the other guys, but also helping me, because there will be days where I'm like, e, what, what do you think about today? Should it be a practice day? Should it, be, should it just be a film day? How, what's the pulse of the group? And he's a guy that I lean on for that.